going on, YouTube? United Gamer here, and welcome everyone to another episode of the Pokemon Uranium Nuzlocke. How are you, beautiful people, doing? Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. In the last episode, guys, we took on this beast of a trainer that had Mega Evolution, so we now have that available for ourselves for our starter. But we made it out alive without any really major death, even though it was a double battle. If you missed that episode, make sure to go check it out. You know, it is an hour-long episode, but at least watch that gym fight. It was truly insane. If you guys are still enjoying this series though be sure to show that united family love by smacking that like button comment question of the day this has been a very fun series i have truly enjoyed it guys i'm sorry that it's been put off you know a couple times you know due to you know natural disasters and everything but uh my question to you guys is for future hacks uh would you still like it to be this nuzlocke challenge and make it really difficult or would you rather it be a let's play so we can just enjoy the game and focus on the story let me know in the comment section below to have your chance to be nicknamed a pokemon on this journey i did not mean to go to the pokemon Center. I'm trying to go to the Pokemon Mart because uh, I want to make sure we're good on items. We have a pretty long journey today. We're going to be heading over to the eighth gym. It's pretty insane to say that we're heading our way to the eighth gym. Like, I really feel like even though it's kind of been delayed a couple times, we had just started this series. Uh, there's a few things I haven't liked about this game. For the most part, I've truly enjoyed it. Uh, but a few things that I haven't liked, I cannot stand how we still don't have Fly. I hate how we have seven gym badges, and this is a huge place. There's an East Tandor and a West Tandor, and we still do not have Fly. Never mind, maybe I have plenty of items. God, I did not know I had that many. I just needed some repels. Dang, we are set. We have some good money. We have a nice team. We're looking really nice right now. Uh... But yeah, like, I mean, unless, unless I'm about to get it right here, then I'm so, I'm, I'm so tired of that because we have a long journey ahead if we don't have fly. Then when I flew here on Pache, as soon as I got the phone call from Theo, will it help that I was already in East, East Tandor? I was catching some waves, or I'm doing important field work, that is so. It's true? You managed to defeat the gym and gain the power of Mega Evolution? Yeah. And Dylan and I battled on top of the mountain, that was awesome. Theo, you literally basically did nothing except take hits for me. You're like, our Achilles did alright, but that's about it. Wonderful. Goodness, it's been so long. Look how much you two have grown. I remember when you were in my lab for the first time taking the trainer's test. And you weren't very happy about your result, Theo. And yeah, I wanted to switch with you, Theo. Yeah, don't remind me. But now, I'm glad I have Ach Achilles. We were able to use Mega Evolution together. I mean, even any starter you chose wouldn't be able to do that. <laughs> Indeed, as you know, Mega Evolution was discovered recently in the Kalos region. It involves the reaction between a Mega Stone held by a Pokemon and a Keystone like the one on your Mega Bracelet. This reaction is made possible by the bond that you and your Pokemon share. There are several Tandor Pokemon capable of Mega Evolution, particularly the starter Pokemon that I gave you, really, because we just did that, we know that. In order to evolve them, though, you will need to find their Mega Stones. Those are hidden all around Tandor. I can't say exactly where you'll find them, but you know what, Will? The wiki for this page, or for this game. So there you go. If you want to play this game, you can look it up on there. It's a treasure hunt. Sweet! Yes, that's exactly right. Now then, if you are encountering Mega Pokemon, I'll need to b upgrade both your Pokedexes. Alright, so we get a Pokedex upgrade, which I don't think we have any other Tandor Pokemon that can Mega Evolve besides our starter right now. I mean, I'm pretty sure, but I'm not certain. You'll now be able to record the data on all the Pokemon or Mega Pokemon you encounter. I'll look forward to your findings. Now then, what more can you tell me about your adventure? I see, I see. It sounds like you've uh, seen particularly all of Tandor by now. So, Professor, where do we go now? Alright, well, you're almost finished with the gym challenge. Only one gym remains, and it's, a uh, Angular Town, south of Venice City. Okay, I thought it was in Venice City, or maybe I'm, mis I'm thinking of something else. It's the one below the city we've already been to for the sixth gym, so. Unfortunately, that stretch of ocean is besieged by pirates! Okay, that sounds fun. They're a really big problem here in East Tandor. It makes traveling the seas very difficult. Not to mention, the East Tandor nuclear plant is near Tuskanami as well. I'm worried that whatever or whoever it is that caused the meltdowns will strike again. I ain't afraid of no nuclear Pokemon. Yes, I imagine you two can take care of yourselves. I'm just being cautious, that's all. Plus, there are some Pokemon that uh, there that you will need to complete your Pokedex. There are some rare Pokemon found only at the bottom of the sea. In order for you to find them, I have these HM HMs for you. Well, we got Dive, but it's still not what I need. Where is freaking Fly? This is such a big game. I don't even want to talk to you anymore. No. Unless you give me a fly. All right, so we got to go there to get our eighth gym badge, guys. Forgive me. I must be off. I'm doing research on nuclear Pokemon. The Tandor Rangers are finding a cure for it. Well, I don't have any more nuclear Pokemon alive, too, so that kind of sucks. I want to get that Nucleon, that Evolution. That's a, I guess it's an Evolution. It looked like it was. That's a nuclear type. Man, I would, I want that. That'd be cool. Then we could, uh, you know, save it or whatever. All right, go ahead and you fly off. 
Even though you won't give it to me, do we have to have the eighth gym badge to fly? Like, just go ahead and look right here. This is a gigantic game. This is only East Tandor. So, like, we have to go all the way through Route 16, down through Route 15, 13, to go to here, and then surf all the way down here. But if we had fly, we could fly right here and head down there and make it by today's episode. I don't even know why, because then over here we have West Tandor, and it's just frustrating, honestly. Um, but I think we're going to be okay. The only thing is, I have a lab practical quiz uh, in college, and I cannot miss that. And I have to leave in about, I don't know, about 25, 30 minutes. So I want to record and render this and edit it and everything to make sure you guys get a day. I'm on a schedule, and I can have somebody come by and upload it, I believe. Uh, we'll see. I hope, I hope I can, because I want to make sure you guys get this, uh, episode out, because later tonight I will be live-streaming the Alpha Sapphire Extreme Randomizer if you missed the first, uh, episode or whatever. It was a lot of fun. I don't know if I battled you or not, but I really don't want to battle anybody as much as I can today. I want to make progress. I think we already came up here and touched that. Yeah, we did. All right, so we got to go down. Uh, or did, or are we not supposed to come right here? Oh, yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. We gotta go down right here. I remember now. Because that one, that one took me a while to get through. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, though. Alright, so before we go any further, though, I do need to go ahead and load the bonus round spinner up. And see what we can get for today. Can we get a bonus, please? A lucky freaking day! Let's go, baby! Oh, my God. The time I am actually in a rush. I finally get a lucky day. I have been trying to get this in so many series, and I have never had the luck, but, you know, behind me. But finally, I can bring somebody back to life. I don't even know who... I kind of want Enzo, my boy Enzo, for the ground type aspect. And he has another evolution. Enzo would be a great member of our team. He can take hits, too. So I think I want Enzo for us. All right. Legata Chris, let's see what you can do with this mega evolution. You're five levels higher. It's a nice type. It can't do anything to you anyway. Hit this thing with an, uh, a Thunderbolt, and we'll be good to go. Let's go ahead and see what you can do for us, buddy. I still wish it had three evolutions and then a mega evolution. It's another little thing I don't like about this game. There's not really many things I don't like about this game. I can deal with anything besides fly. I hate how you get that so late in the game. That's really just annoying to deal with. Uh, mainly because I don't think we're going to be able to make it to the next city today. And I, I, even though we're getting the 8th gym badge right now, I bet we're not really near the end of the game. I could be wrong because we really haven't done anything with the story. Or the, like, there has to be, like, a legendary Pokemon in this game. I've seen it on the cover and everything. And we've learned nothing about him. Nothing about him. So I don't know what or where he's going to come into action or what. Uh, I think you're actually a water type, aren't you? So we're going to be super effective. You're definitely going to die. All right, so we're going to use my lucky day on... Wow, you survived that? Look, guy, Chris, you're a Mega Evolve, and you still cannot kill that thing. A Mega Evolve, a Mega Evolution, and you still cannot kill him. You know, I, I am going to use that on Enzo, probably, but I'm going to save it to the end of the episode just to make sure we don't lose, like, Ga like I, Chris, or Willow, or uh, Hollow, or anything. Uh, because I refuse to lose any of my main members right now. I need all three of them. Because I don't know what the 8th gym levels are going to be at like. But I know they can't be good. I know they got to be pretty difficult. Uh, Alright, so let's do this. It's always easier trying to go back. Okay, so I think we just got to keep going down. Alright, I don't know who we've battled, who we haven't battled. Okay, I remember going in here. Uh, let's see, we saw the repel live. And, um, we still- okay, hold on. Before we go, though, I do want to go ahead and heal up the guy, Chris, because I don't want to risk him losing him today. We got a lot of hyper potions, and I have some super potions. Yeah, I have three, okay. We'll use one of those. That's good enough. I don't think he's gonna die or anything, so, uh, as long as something's not ground and I don't know about it, then we'll be okay. All right, we've already had our encounters for all up here, too, so technically I could use a twin sanity, but... Most importantly, I think it's better for me to go ahead and try to revive somebody. Uh, I'm going to save it because we're already going to town. So. Um, let me see. Let me check the Pokemon Center really quick. If I can find wherever it is. Is it... Okay, there it is. All right. I think it's going to be Enzo, but I want to see everybody. I want to make sure I'm not missing anybody important uh, for that. Okay, let's see. Oh, my God, our death box is so big. And over there, we have an egg. Uh, a grass and electric, which I already have electric, but I don't have a, I don't have a grass type, so Enzo is definitely the way to go. You know, this guy's pretty good, but he's quite weak to ice. This guy's not cool. Oh, yeah, never mind. He's quite weak to grass. Um, but this guy can take hits. You know, he's got some pretty good defense. He's a low level right now, and I'm almost certain he has another evolution, uh, and he has really good special attack. And I, does he have an up in special or up in attack? 
Up in defense, okay, and down in special defense. That's kind of sucks. Um, but I, I, Enzo has been clutch this, the entire series. And when he died, that was really a heartbreaker for me. So I think I'm going to bring him back to life. I think he's definitely the best one on the team to bring back. And I think it's more important to do that than a twin sanity. Because uh, whenever I get a new Pokemon, for all I know, they could absolutely suck. And we do have that other guy on our team right now, then he could be pretty good. What are you doing? Oh, you, yeah, you wouldn't happen to be a Pokemon trainer now, would you? <laughs> now, I can't tell just by looking at you. Listen, I've been selling these oceans since I was a wee lad. As of late, there's been an ill tide. You have, must have heard, but there are pirates in these waters. A frail of a fisherman like me doesn't stand a chance against him, but with a strong trainer on board, I reckon that I can leave us alone. Oh, uh, you perhaps heading to Venice City? I'd be more happy to give you a lift here. Okay, so this kind of makes up for the lack of fly. So there you go. Good job, game creators. Thank you. Or, I mean, uh, I blew it. So he's actually a pirate, I'm guessing. Yeah, okay. I take a, I was taking a pretty big guess just because of how he was talking. Uh, but then he said he's catchphrase. Give me your Pokemon or you'll be walking the plank. All right, let's see what we got here, Captain Jack. He's actually, his name is Jack! <laughs> I swear I did not know that. Oh, I want the Swaboon. Swaboon, Swaboon. I want him. It's like a Cubone kind of pirate form. All right, uh, we'll use a Scald on that thing and a Moonblast on that one. I want that thing, though. Um, I can't believe his name was actually Jack. What are the chances for that? Can I take his boat, though, after I'm done with this? All right, we got Drizzle. Really? Is that his ability? Have I missed that or something? All right. Um, we did not get the one shot. Wow, that's kind of disappointing. All right, Skull, that should still be a one shot from you. Good job, the guy, Chris. You knocked out the little dude. Feel kind of bad because he's kind of adorable, but uh, Poison Sting. Okay. Not going to kill me, though. All right, eat it up. No poison. No poison. Oh, okay. I thought he got poison because it stalled, but it's just a bloodlust. All right, so a Hagross. What is that thing? All right, it looks like it's maybe poison as well. Maybe electric. I don't know. Maybe dragon. He might be a dragon type. I don't know. If I, I, all right, I'm going to say with what I'm doing. He's using a sucker punch on me. Who used that? Was that the new guy, Hagross? If that's so, then he's dark. Or he could be dark, but that's not going to one-shot him, I don't think. No, I didn't think so. He looked like he was kind of a bulky Pokemon, and the levels are catching up with us now. All right, getting that experience. Nice. All right, so this is the last Pokemon. Uh, just Scald and just Aura Sphere on this thing. I, I kind of wish that Aura Sphere would have landed so I could see if this thing was dark type. It looks like it would be poison, honestly. With all that the purple body, just kind of makes it look like poison. Maybe poison and dark. Pirate Jack. Arrgh! Arrgh. Silver's so gone mad at me for this. Mark my words, Latin lover. You haven't seen nothing the last of Pirate Jack. Anchors away. No! Let me have his boat. Excuse me, I watched your battle from afar. That guy was a pirate, right? I thought he might be. Normally the black pirate flags... Don't stray this far for north. They're getting May rowdy as of late. Anyway, I wanted to thank you. You showed him a lesson. Hopefully, uh, he won't come sniffing around Silverport again. If there's anything I could do, yes, you can give me a ride. Thank you. Are you a pirate too? <laughs> Are you a pirate for some reason? Thank you so much. That saves me so much time. All right, I'm still like in awe that his name was actually Jack. The only reason I said that was because of Captain Jack Sparrow, but. Uh, from the Pirates of the Caribbean. Let's see. A Pokemon Center. No, I don't know what the Pokemon Center is. And so we might actually do pretty well. All right. So it's 145 right now. My class is at three. Um, but it's like a 40 minute drive is the issue. And I still have to edit and everything. But for right now, guys, uh, we're going to go ahead and take a little short break and have today's United Bonus Round. Welcome to the United Bonus Round. In the previous episode, we heard the following Pokemon's cry. This was none other than the Pokemon Regirog. Now, answer the following Pokemon's cry correctly to send United Gamer a challenge or a bonus in an upcoming episode. Ten of you must get this correct to complete this bonus round. Let's get back into the video. All right, everybody, let's keep heading over, and we'll see if we can get to the next city. Uh, well, I'll try to do as best as I can. Um, I hope we'll be able to. All right, so we already had an encounter here, too. Uh, I can avoid as many... Tr I, oh, I thought I had a repel live, but I must have took it off. We already had an encounter, or I would catch this thing. I remember having one earlier on. 
Um, which kind of sucks too, because I wouldn't mind having that. Even though I don't need another water type, and I think he's a water and psychic. The psychic would be cool, but I don't need a I don't need another water type. Go ahead. You did not even one-shot it. Are you kidding me, Legiacris? You are literally like 15 levels higher, and you can't one-shot the thing. I think he's bulky, but still, no excuses. Alright. I'm, like I said, I'm not going to revive Enzo until the end of the episode, so, alright, let me use a Repel before we go on. Uh, Max Repel is fine. Let's see, who is the lowest level? Is it Ligarcus or Hollow? It's Hollow right now. We're always a beast. We don't really need to train him up, which I imagine they're going to get around like level 65 when we actually take on the gym. Um, oh, do I need Dive? I do need, a, I need, I do need Dive. Dang it. All right, let's see if can anybody learn dive besides Legiacris because if that's not the case then this kind of sucks Because I don't want to have to I don't want to teach it to him Yes, my boy star even though you're dead star you're technically you can do, still use you because I mean like I said before if you can fly on a dead Pokemon uh, Whenever they're fainted you can I can use a dead Pokemon in a Nuzlocke to be an ATM slave I just Legiacris knows all the moves he needs to know Scald is really good Thunderbolt's good Magnet Rise for the case that it's ground and uh, this is technically the same route so uh, Oh, oh, oh we barely made it out. Okay, so Man, I wish there was a speed up button. I want to make sure I, I want to do my best to get to the next city, but I have to edit this. Uh, but I should be all right. You know, once it gets to the later series, I don't really have to do too much. All right, let's go ahead and grab this. We'll get as close as we can. TM97 super fun. There's a lot of TMs in this game too. Um, let's. Can I go up right here? Is that what I do? Yes. Yeah, okay. So that's where I need to go back up. All right. That's not really that obvious looking. <laughs> Uh, but now we can keep going down. All right, so route four. That's still right 14. Never mind. That's where we were Route 14. I'm almost certain that's where we actually still were so If not we can come back now. Are we really already here? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on Is it that short? We're already there. I expected that look that look, all right. That makes no sense. That was so fast All right, wait, this is the next but he said ankler village ankler village. I don't know but I swear this is where the gym is. I remember looking up to make sure I go to the right place, but are we really already here? You have arrived, just as we were told. You are welcome to our village. When you are ready, the master awaits you in his dojo. Okay, that's kind of weird. All right, I gotta figure out if this is where the gym is. Like, I'm almost certain this is where it is, but I don't want to take the gym on today. No, I am not ready for no gym right now. Uh, no, I'm good. I like this city though. As a kid, as a kid, guys, this would be the best Pokemon place ever. I was obsessed with ninjas as a kid. I thought they were so cool. Like, one of my favorite games was a game by the name of I Ninja, uh, which I would still love to do that on YouTube one day, just because, like, that would be so much fun. It's such a classic game for me. But anyways, like, I loved ninjas. I read books about ninjas. I was obsessed with it, but is this the, is this a dojo? This looks like a gym, though. Does that say dojo? I didn't even read it. Legendary Museum. So, all right, it's a museum. It's not a... I guess that's the one over here is a dojo. Well, I mean, we'll peep, we'll peep in and take a little visit. As long as nothing dies, we'll be all right. But yeah, dude, this this place would have been so cool to me as a kid. The white this this is the gym. I'm almost certain. Hey, would you look at that? You made it here at last. This is the eighth and final gym. And no, no, I'm not preparing for this. The gods are uh, 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 Otis, uh, Otis and Mutius, and the gym leaders are the prince and the princess of the ninja clans. Not only that, but they're said to be the mortal voice of the gods themselves. To reach them, you'll have to solve a puzzle. Remember, Otius and Motius, uh, Mutius uh, are all about balance. Don't freak out, okay? You can handle this. I believe in you. No, 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 no. No, I cannot. All right, so I don't know what Ankular Village is, because that's where he said the gym was, but th they said this is the final gym, so... I mean, that's fine. We've, we haven't been recording that long. So I guess what we'll do is we'll do some more battling. And I want to go see what this grass patch was over here. I was not expecting to get to this gym this quick. Or I would have trained off cam and been ready to fight the gym. But I'm but I'm not. We've already had a Route 14 encounter, which that's a duplication anyway. Uh, but I want to see what this grass patch is over here. All right, Hollow. I wish Hollow could make it evolve and it turns into Ho-Oh. That would, or that would be so funny. All right, well, I don't know why I keep running into stuff. So I'm going to use a Repel. I want to at least get over there. Like I said, this is going to be definitely a shorter episode. Uh, but I mean, nothing I can really do about that. I can't record for an hour like I did last time. And 
Are we close to the end of the game? Are we really that close? It's starting to feel like it. If we're already at the eighth gym, when are we gonna have like the story of the game? Like all these the nuclear explosions and stuff. Does that happen at the end? TM58 endure. I guess that's that's okay. It's not the best thing in the world. Uh, and this is still uh, Route 14, so there's nothing really here for us. My nose is itching so bad. All right, let me go back up here. So, I guess we get a... What? All right, I guess we're going to have some battles right here. All right, surrender your Pokemon. I will sink you to the bottom of the sea. Why didn't they... Wait, why didn't they ambush me when I first got out of the dive area? <laughs> that makes no sense. Oh, Jack, this is, this, why, uh, this is why you're only a swabby. If you can bring the captain some strong Pokemon, we'll definitely get our promotion. Maybe even a ship of our own. Listen, kid, you might have beat my partner, but there's no way you can handle both of us together. All right, everybody, we have a double battle right here. I'm ready for you, though. I don't know why they didn't ambush me in the first place, but uh, all right, we have a double battle with Pirate Jack and Pirate Silva. Uh, Villacard and a Swaboon level. Okay, it's the same pretty much Pokemon, so... Um... I'm gonna go with a Lava Plume and a Moon Blast on this one. I wanna see what that Swabone can do. Let's see, how much damage is that gonna do? Okay, good amount. That's, that's not bad. We're gonna finish it off with the, uh, the Lava Plume, so. Wanna make sure we get one dead, so now we can only take one attack. Alright, you're gonna eat that up, though. You're gonna eat it up, Willow. I know you are. All right, I know that's not going to kill him. It shouldn't. All right, he must have pretty dang bad defenses because that's ridiculous. A superpower. That's not going to be super effective on anybody. Okay, so he's a fighting type. He has some pretty good damage with him, which superpower is a good PP, but that's not very effective to hollow, so that's not bad. Next up, you have a Hagross. Okay, so I still don't know what this thing is, um, but shoot, can we... You think we could be all right with doing that, or should I heal? I know, I know how. Ah, uh, man. We should outspeed him, and that'll kill him. So I'm gonna do that. Actually, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. What I'm gonna do is just do an air slash on this guy, because he seems to be fighting anyway. And then a moon blast on this, because I, I don't know what type this thing is, but I'm trying to figure it out. Why do you have a tubber reel? I wish I would have known that. Not very effective. All right, so it is definitely a poison type. Okay, now I know. Do a decent amount of damage, please. Thank you. All right. Come on, Willow. Come on. Oh, he attacked Hollow. Why? Oh, it is both. It's a sludge wave, wasn't it? Oh, my God. Clutched up. And even hurt your own Pokemon, so that's all right. Uh, what I'm going to do here is I am going to use a Hyper Potion right here on you. And I am going to not run. Did not mean to hit run. I am going to switch out to Legiacris. Uh, and Mega Evolve. So I want to make sure everybody's fully healed. I'm worried about that Tubble Reel. That's the only one I'm worried about. I'm hoping he uses Sludge Wave again so he can hurt his own Pokemon. Uh, but we're pretty much fully healed. Sucker Punch and it failed. Let's go. That's so nice. Aqua Tail. All right. Eat it up. Come on, Hollow. All right. There goes my lucky day. Lucky day is going to Hollow for us. Dang it. That's so frustrating. But I, I couldn't I couldn't keep Willow out, which is not very effective with him either. All right, that's fine. We'll finish off Tuberil right here. We got a lucky day. We'll bring him back. I wanted to bring back Enzo, but it's okay. If that's just how it's going to roll, that's what we're going to have to do. All right, so we got a heal hollow. Well, it's always freaking Tuberil, too. It just sucks because I didn't know he's going to have one of those, and I couldn't switch out. I couldn't switch out both of them. Uh, let, oh, no, 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 no. Let me mega, mega evolve, and we'll get rid of Tuberil because we'll definitely outspeed this thing. All right, and make sure you heal up Willow, because I know you can survive a hit. A drizzle. There we go. Hyper Potion Willow's good. All right, so as long as they don't... As long as we can knock this thing out, which we definitely should. Super effective. I just wish I would have had him at the front in the beginning. That would have been this. That made this a lot better. Dang it, I wanted to bring back Enzo so bad. It's all... I swear, Tuberil is my worst enemy. Like, I hate that Pokemon. He always kills my Pokemon. All right, well, we know we can eat it up, and uh, he got the poison off, though. I have a full restore, though, so that's okay. Um, all right, this is all right. So I want to knock that thing out really bad. The Swaboon, I don't think he can do anything to me. 
Uh, so what I'm gonna do is use my only full restore, actually. I thought I had more than one. And then do everything I can to knock this thing out. So with, uh, with the drizzle, I think the skull should definitely kill this thing. It should. There's no way this thing should live this. Not with the drizzle out. It's a beast if it does. Okay, there we go. It's doing, it's doing all right so far. And superpower, that's going to be on Legaricus, I imagine. Yeah, okay, but Legaricus, and I know you can live that. All right, whoa, that was a critical hit, though. It, <laughs> oh, man. All right, do you have more Pokemon, or are we done with this? You have more. You have another one of them. Okay, that's all right, though. Uh, what I'll do is just a Moonblast on the one that's not hurt. And uh, even though I could probably outspeed the thing, uh, I don't want to risk it. Uh, let me go ahead and use a Hyper Potion to make sure we're fully healed. Uh, this Moonblast should kill this thing in one hit. I think it's fighting type. Yeah, super effective. Okay, so Swabone is dead. And then we'll finish off the other one. Because he's probably going to use Super Power again, isn't he? Hammer Arm. All right, well, that's going to end up killing you. I don't know why you went and did that. You know, that's going to mess you up really bad. Your speed's failed. Now we're definitely going to ask for you to do There's nothing you can do. Uh, we're good to go, honestly. Moonblast and a Scald. All right. So we lost Hollow, but we had a lucky day live. If you don't know what that means, from the auto bonus round, that means we get to use any bonus possible. And what that is, is obviously we're just going to go with an extra life on uh, Hollow. So he actually did not die. So the last Pokemon is the evolution of that. All right, so Moonblast again. And a uh, Scald. Honestly, I bet the Scald might kill this thing. I don't think he, I think he's a sweeper. He doesn't have good defenses. Yeah, see, yeah. Uh, and he doesn't even outspeed me. He should have high speed if he's going to be like that. I don't I don't really get that Pokemon, but... All right. Of course, it's the Tuberil that kills me, but it's all right. We brought him back to life. And next episode, we're going to be taking on the gym. Jack, you idiot. This is your fault. Everybody, that is going to be it for this episode. I know it's a little bit shorter, but uh, we still made it out. We had a death here. No, 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 no. No ninjas. I don't got to battle anybody else, do I? Or are they going to just, like, shoot them away? Oh, there's... They... They're bat- Why does that the blackout? I'd like to like to watch that. We're sorry we cannot arrive sooner, boss. Yeah, you should have arrived sooner. Dylan is strong and noble. You should be welcome to our village. It is suits Konomi. We have our house. Please visit it if you're- Why? Okay, so I feel like they were supposed to ambush me way before this ever happened. But for some reason, they didn't. Like, they did not ambush me there. So I don't know what that was, but, uh... Alright guys, that is going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you're new to the channel and you enjoyed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join the United Family today. You can find me on all kinds of social media links like Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram. All that can be found in the description below. As always everybody, this is not just a channel, it is a family and I cannot wait to see you all in the next episode. I'm out!